Hi, it's Amy and I got some pink highlights, pink streaks in my hair. It's a lot more vibrant as a person. I wanted to do something crazy, but not too crazy. Um, something to make me happy every time I look at it. Um, something that will take my mind off things thing that if you watched my videos from last month um, you would remember I did a video called the boyfriend tag and then there was the bloopers for that. You won't be seeing any more of James because we are no longer together. If I'm heartbroken, it's been a few days now. It's not getting much better. I'm not going to go into detail because I can't. There are not very many people who I have told. Um, I'm going through a lot of different emotions. I think I'm in waves. I'm a very caring person and I'm very s strong in a, in the sense that if someone needs someone to talk to, to hug, to listen and it's very hard for me to really let my guard down and cry and be openly sad in front of my friends and in front of people because I feel like I should be helping them. They shouldn't need to worry about me. I'm going from crying my eyes out to hating myself, to blaming myself, to blaming him, to hating him, missing him like crazy. I mean, I don't know what to do in this situation. I've never been in this particular situation. Yes, I've had boyfriends. I was the one breaking up with them. It was massive, like bombshell, which it would have been for them and if they are watching this then I'm truly sorry. I've always been sorry for hurting you guys. I still care about you incredibly. Being on the receiving end of it is devastating. And I know that it's also devastating to be the one breaking up. I've been hanging out with friends. I am finding that that is the best thing to do. I want to thank you guys if you're watching. I'm sorry that this is going up tomorrow or Sunday. Um, what I think we're is for today for sitting with me, letting me cry on your shoulder, letting me talk when I wanted to talk and babbling on <laughs> about other things when I didn't, letting me rant and obsess and fan girl over K-pop idols and other incredibly 
attractive and nice guys that you know or I know Stephen rushing over and just letting me cry and hugging me I don't know how long that was um Jamie no thank you for taking me out and yeah letting me talk and letting me be silent I want to thank everyone at Kato at my acting academy school place we were all incredibly incredibly nice I love all of you Kat and Ash and the other cat, <laughs> um, David and Hayden, Pat, Amy, um, Isaac, Liam, Claire, and Rob, and Dan, and Scott, and Tiana, and Renee. <laughs> There are a couple of from Kato I did not mention, but that's because I don't think they know. This is really hard for me. Um, and just because I'm not crying at the moment doesn't mean that this is fake or I'm doing this for intention or ruse or anything like that. Like I said, I find it extremely hard to show this kind of emotion. I'm sorry that if the next few videos will be like this picture of us at year 10, semi-formal, which is when he asked me out. And in that was a little piece of paper I had written on it, reasons why I love you. And I took all of that, gave it to my stepdad, and told him to put it into the garage. I even put the necklace that he <laughs> got me when he went to New Zealand on the school trip. I have been wearing that necklace pretty much every single day from when he gave it to me. And taking it off and putting it into that box. It was one of the hardest things I've ever done. I don't know what to do. Please don't hate him. Please don't treat him badly. Because at the end of the day, we still care about each other. I still love him. And he still really cares. I don't want to see him get hurt. Very slim chance. James is watching this. Sorry. <sighs> Sorry that it didn't work out. For the two years. Four months and two days of our relationship. I was the happiest. I think I've ever been, and it was all because of you. I'm gonna stop it out because I really don't want to cry on camera. That's it for this video. And I will talk to you next Saturday. Curly face. Bye.